Hello and welcome back to Persona 5 Royal. So, we are in the palace and we need to effectively get the chief director's badge so we can go and open up all of the doors. How do we do this? Well, we have to kill all of the underlings, get their badges, that then lets us access higher underlings, which then we can get their badges until eventually we get to the chief director's room, kill the chief director, get his badge, and then we're laughing. Chief director, we have learned, is weak to psychokinesis, which Haru, our new friend, has. Sorry, Noir, because we're in the palace. And that's basically the plan. So, console. We're in. Hopefully. Access granted. Wonderful. I'm so glad. Great, this one's open as well. We've got to be close to the end, right? The chief director is usually directly above the section chief. Don't forget to be conscious of your condition, everyone. If you're feeling tired, be sure to rest at a safe room. Ah, we already have. That's... Hold it, guys. This room's different. I can't sense anything weird inside. Probably safe to assume there aren't any high-ranked robots in there. Well, sounds like there's no point in checking it out. Hmm. Not quite. If we don't have any bosses watching, it might be a good opportunity to get something good. I see. Good point. Joker, let's sneak by them and listen in on their conversation. Sure. Hmm. I'm going to have this. Who are you? Why aren't you working? <laughs> Shit, we got caught! These guys are trying to slack off! Report them! <laughs> we got too close. Let's withdraw from now and reorganize. Alright, cool. Just sneak up close. If I complain near the chief director, he'll say. Whoa. Uh, something I can't read. Oh, so basically eavesdropping on him. It's a divine skill of mine. <sighs> Impressive. I can see how you've managed to wiretap LeBlanc for so long. That, oh, that was nothing. Someday I'll show you what real wiretapping is. <laughs> In any case, there's no denying that this is a smart move. We'll just have to obtain information from the group about what their boss is like. Hold a moment. There appears to be a few of them further in. Let us obtain their information as well. Yeah, can I get this guy's one again though? Because you brought up the conversation on top of it. I'm happy to be able to work for this company. Oh, wonderful. I'm happy to be able to work for this company. The chief director loves talking about his past. Okay. It's only up for a second, so I need to read it quickly. Only cause trouble for everyone if I collapse now. The chief director of the company is the best of the best. Okay. We've heard a good amount. What do you think, Joker? I know all I need to know. Let's get out of here before we get caught. Okay. Sure. Uh, so that'll be the chief director. So what is in here then? Because this is the remaining room we've not got. What's that could also be the chief director. So what's in here? Double authentication. Access denied. Okay. Fair enough. Hmm. Ah, another roadblock. Is this one rank authentication as well? Hmm. We can get through here if we have a chief director ID card or higher. Although, given the layout of the floor, it doesn't look like this leads to a new area or anything. Yes. So our main goal remains with the door we found downstairs. Why don't we skip through all this shit and just nab the president's ID? I want to get this over with. Alright. So now we need to go in here and find somebody who's talking about the best of the best. Mwahum! Who are you rascals? How did you get in here? Oh, what business do you have here at the best of the best corporation? Okumura Foods? Uh, are you the chief director? Mm, uh, oh, you, I think you figured it out. You must be the rumored Phantom of the Eves. Graffa <laughs> Very well, I'll tell you the truth. I am indeed the chief director. Whether you choose to believe that or not is up to you. Now then. Is that all you wanted to ask me? Uh, let's discuss the future. Uh, someone of no stability ask you about the future? Grahahaha, how naive. The future is a trifling matter for a boy like you. 
Although I will admit it is an interesting subject. Joker. It's time we made a decision, Joker. What should we do? Leave. Hmm. Because I want to go and do the other fight, which isn't the chief director. Because we can get XP for it. Hmm, who are you? What are you tiny brats like you doing here? We're the Phantom Thieves. Phantom Thieves? So you admit to intruding in this place. How brazen of you. It's time I teach you all a lesson. Hmm, I was just feeling in the mood for a spot of excitement. Let us do this, Joker. Yeah, I knew this wasn't the right guy, but that's fine. Uh, so we know these guys are weak to wind and fire. Uh, so I don't know whether the one at top is actually weak to psychokinesis, but they might be. So let's try it. They are, because they're the same type. Wonderful. Uh, will baton pass over to... Let's go on. Follow it with one of these. Nice. You want to surrender? Absolutely not. Alright. Great formation. Switch over to Haru. Who's then going to hit with one of those. And it's dead. Wonderful. There's our XP. There's some level ups. Perfect. <laughs> Serves you right, bastard. That takes care of that. This guy's got nothing on him, though. Hundred, a thousand percent waste of time. Um, it, it seems their physical size doesn't necessarily correlate to the rank. The chief director must be somewhere else. Let's try looking in another room. It's odd that, you know, if you want to be optimal with your rewards for the dungeon, you have to get the answer to the puzzle wrong. That's kind of intriguing. Uh, also, um, I remembered something from the last episode I never looked at. So Arn has the red band on, right? Let me see if I can find it. Yeah, the red band. So the red band gives her the ability fire boost. Now, what I've been told, whether this is true or not, I don't know, because I have not, you know, checked into it any further. But I've been told that if she has the ability fire boost on here, they do not stack because they're both called fire boost, if that makes sense. So I should actually give her a different ability, a different thing, because she already has, like, she already has fire boost as an ability. So let's try something else. What have we got? Uh, we don't give her any of those ones. Uh, that's all stats plus three. Crazy. Um, seeing. So further down. What's heat up anyway? Yeah, okay, that's pretty good. Uh, let's see. Hmm, life gain doesn't really seem good. Yeah, the problem is we don't actually have that many good ones outside of uh, the ones that came from the uh, DLC. Yeah. I don't really like the plus skill ones either. It's like give her the heat wave one. That gives her a physical attack that does damage, but it's not really her thing. I guess I'll give her the champion's cup. It, it gives her a heal and a buff, maybe? I don't know. It's not. I'm not happy with that answer. I guess I'll just give her null forget for just now. It's fine. It's some, something different. If she seems to be doing a significant amount less damage, then we might switch her back because it will seem like it's buffing, but I don't believe it is. Hello. Uh, let's talk for a bit. I don't like your tone, but okay, speaking with young people is rare for me. I am also... I oh, I also almost never interact with such lowly individuals. ha <laughs> ha What's the matter? Go on, let's continue this conversation. Uh, let's discuss the past. Uh, admirable, you wish to hear of my successes, yes? Back when... I, uh, back... Everyone was humble, like you, back when I was young. But youth nowadays... Joker. Yeah, let's uh, fight him. Okay. Hey, you were only meant to talk to him so he could uh, reveal information about himself. So, so uh, let's try the exact same thing we just did, which is Zion down. the big guy. Nice. nice it's on pass to on. Fire. Don't hold up. 
baton pass to Haru. Hits him with Sai. And he's dead. Okay, seems like the fire did roughly the same amount of damage. Yeah, cool. Eee, a level up. Nice. Perfect. We finally found the Chief Director's ID card. This means we can go into that rank door downstairs now. Well, let's go check it out. Time to make like a banana and split. Okay. And we can use this to get through these doors. Just thought I'd skip past some of the uh, animation there. Perfect. Yes, it opened. Now we can move freely about this floor. Perfect. We have the employee ID card we were after. Let's head downstairs when we're done here. Uh, so map-wise, we've been everywhere, so I guess we'll just go and save and then head downstairs. Sounds good to me. So, all the way over here. And in. Right. Anyone got anything new? Oh, we do. Must be tough as a middle manager having to consider both your boss's demands and your employees' needs. Now, we shall can we finally go? progress, don't worry. I can keep going, I made up my mind some time ago. <laughs> Let's see, what section would I make a good chief of? Oh, who am I kidding? I just have to be the chairman. The aesthetics leave much No one to be performs designed. adequately for anyone that strict. Yeah, middle management also tends this. to fall into, what's it, I think it's called the Peter Principle. I, I think that's what it's called, which is the, everybody gets promoted to the point where they are okay. incompetent. Basically, the idea is, you are good at your job, right? So, you are a good worker. So, you get promoted to be, like, supervisor of the workers. And you're a good supervisor, so you get promoted to be a manager. But you're not a good enough manager to be promoted to the next level. So, you end up just kind of like an incompetent manager when you could be, like, a really good supervisor, if that makes sense. So it's the idea that everyone will always be promoted because they're doing well, to the point where they are no longer doing well. Which is an interesting thought, right? Because it makes a lot of sense. And, uh, yeah, it kind of explains a lot of problems with the company, where you're like, actually, what you should do, maybe, like, if you were trying to make things efficient, is you should find people who would be good managers, and then just... If you want to give a reward to the person below, instead of promoting them up to be a manager, you just reward them for being good at, like, very good at the position they're at. Which is interesting. Um, is there not another door back this way? I thought there was another door we couldn't open all the way back here. Grab this guy. Show me your true form. I don't know whether we can do the insta-kills in here. I assume maybe we can. I should try it. No, I'll try it next time. We technicaled into an all-in attack. I suppose we could have talked there and captured, but hey, we didn't. But we do get Sifu Taba destroy this guy again. Nice. Okay. Huh? That was a little too easy. Uh. No, there wasn't another door. <laughs> I uh, the other door I was thinking of was the one that we came through that was next to the elevator. Oops. That's fine. Let's head this way and get this one. Console. Um. We brought the employee ID from the ch from a chief director. We'll be able to pass through now. Of course. Well, probably. Authenticating, and we're in. Nice. All right. Hell yeah! Finally. You know, it is. It's a little odd. I thought Okumura might be behind the mental shutdowns, but we haven't found anything even remotely pointing to such a secret so far. Something that important might be deeper in. Let's just keep going. It's also possible that its political connections are behind it, which would fit in with, you know, the guy with the weird uh, orange glasses who's a politician. It would fit in with the director. Like, you know, and Okumura is simply working with them, and he doesn't know the full details around why these things are happening. 
you know, that could be a theory. So he's connected, but indirectly connected. Like, maybe he's financing the politicians. Like, he finances them, they get rid of his competitors, he continues to finance them, kind of thing. I don't know. But he also wants to get into politics himself, so who knows? I can feel it. Uh, okay. Look, that building is where the treasure is. We're not far. If it's seriously that close, can't we just go from outside? No point going through there. Hmm. That might be worth a try. Okay. Well, I'm gonna guess there's a reason it won't work, but also. Hey, we're in the next safe room. Anyone have anything new to say in here? Yeah, we have something from Arn. Hmm. Chief Clerk, Section Chief, Chief Director, I guess I kinda understand what they all are, but which one's actually the highest rank? Do you have any idea? Yes, yeah, Chief Director. That's because it was the one that had the ID that we just went through this whole thing. I guess she just doesn't pay attention. All right. Way to score an ID, Joker. You just make me more and more proud to navigate you guys. I should write something. All right, let's uh, do a save. I can't remember whether I created a new save or not this time, but I'll create another new save. All right, I think I did, looking at the okay. timer. That's fine. Uh, so what are other options rather than use this? There are no other options. Well, let's do this then. That's very cool. Uh. I figure out which way to go here. It's not entirely clear. This way? Which then gets us to one of these. Sure. I'm just gonna follow it until we find Oh, so this takes us back over here. Huh. Okay. Oh, I guess because the thing that we grappled off of is no longer available. Okay. Somewhere. Yeah, because it's over here. Alright. Just seems weird to have a shortcut to, like, to the place that you literally just were. It's like, alright. It's a bit weird. Uh, this way? You can't see me because I have to jump there, right? I'll reveal there we go. I couldn't even jump because I was stuck. Because uh, it was blocking the path. Oh, Mothman. Uh, oh no, you're vampire moths. You're slightly different. You still do electric, which means that you're going to be weak to wind? Maybe? I don't have winds. Uh, let's just test curse. Okay. Is it wind? Or you might be resistant to wind. Never mind, you're neutral. Uh, fire? One's dead because we kept them with every uh, thing. Well, that's not good. Hostage situation. A knockdown party member may be taken as a hostage. Whether or not you can rescue them depends on your negotiation ability, so choose your words wisely. When an ally has been taken hostage, you can request help from the Thieves Guild to rescue them without fail. However, you can only request help a certain number of times during any given metaverse infiltration. These will replenish when the date changes. Friend in danger, what you do? Me lacking stamina lately, give me some of yours. Uh, you're up, Panther. No, oh, how could you take that from us? What's wrong? Buy water from I, fine. Me, let you off hook for health. Uh, fine, you you win. Sure. Wahaha, <laughs> me contented. Me give back your friend. Me have no problems. We back to fighting now. A woo. Weak to flying. Uh, like, weak to uh, gun. Huh? You're flying. Oh, and then we get the insta kill anyway. Got them. Hey, a level up. Okay. 
she's almost caught up to our level, right? Yeah, she's only a couple levels behind now. Um, let's quickly use skill from Morgana for heal. There we go. I have something. Uh, I have no idea which way to go here, I'll be honest with you. It's very confusing to me. We'll go this way and grab what's in the chest. Black rock. That's fine. Assuming that these aren't connected, maybe they are. A strong one. I can tell. That's Show fine, we got them. Ah, this thing. So we don't know what it's weak to. Uh, but it might be ice, so let's try ice. Bufula. We froze it, which is cool. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna skip our turns. An enemy's frozen. Let's so we skip its strike. turn. Yeah, cool. So now I get another chance to try an ability on it, which is what I wanted to do. Hmm. Let's try physical anyway. We technical, but that's fine. Great formation. Baton pass to on. Try fire on it. We knew it was likely to resist because it's got it does fire. Hey, at least we got a counter on that one. Oh, we we got hit. That's not good. Uh, try this one. Nope. Okay. We could lullaby it, I suppose. Nice. I want to skip Haru's turn so it stays lullabied on. Never mind. It blocked that one, huh? That's fine. Ooh, showtime. Sure, showtime it. Well, that killed it. I'm glad we won. I didn't know that Showtime would do technical damage as well. That's useful to know. Hmm. Bunch of level ups. All right, level up. Think we got any new abilities this time? We did. New skill. Ice boost. Hmm. That definitely seems good, given you have ice abilities. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of Tet. Well, I'm gonna get rid of Tetracarn. I'm not gonna use it. Oh, also that's that one fully leveled. Okay. Nice. Uh, if that one's fully leveled, just see you also have ice, right? You do. I should use I should use you for ice now. I'll also switch to you so we start in combat with that one. All right, we can stand in the center. What's this? It's green. What does green mean? I'll reveal your true form. Oh, it means it's one of these things. Alright. Yeah, but the thing is, if I gunfire, I'm going to knock it down. No, I got it, right? We hit this one. Then that lets us baton pass. Yeah, let's just do it like this. I was thinking maybe I could do a double baton pass, but I don't need to do that. Then triple down. Wow, we didn't hit it with a single one. Oh no. I love that it didn't actually uh, hit a single hit on it. There we are. We didn't hit a single one of the three shots on it. Remind me to never use that ability again if I, like, you know, if we're in danger. Yeah, just do a little heal like that. Shadow defeated. Now Ooh, let's storage capsule. See it. Okay. Nothing here. There's no other way, like, over this way or something. No? Okay. This is messing with my mind, like, the way that this thing is laid out. It, you know, they could probably, like, if it didn't have all of this weird spacey stuff around it, it probably wouldn't look that weird, Show me your but... True form. 
It's just because it's got all, all these different height levels and things in this one. I don't not understand how to get around here. Ooh. Interesting. Alright, so this is an easy star. So you attack this one. That then like shoot baton pass over here. Then use Mazeal. Nice. Then you baton pass over to like, I don't know, Morgana. Then you hit a Micarula. Uh, so that didn't do too much else. Let's attack here. Resisted. I just want to find what you're weak to. Uh, AoE fire. So still don't know what you're weak to. Let's try this. Oh! Weak to gun. Uh, let's talk. My name is Kor Inor. My existence shall become a new part of you. Cool. That's a new one, isn't it? And lots of money and XP. Okay. All right. Let's see what this one's got. Uh, this could be really good, depending on what it has on it. So uh, stats. Oh, it has dodge everything. Not so good then. It increases defense for three turns uh, as well. It has just as an extra thing. Uh, acquire bonus traits when fusing with a treasure demon. Okay. Oh, that's just its ultimate vessel thing. Uh, background. Once called the world's largest diamond, it was cut when it came to the British royal family. It's said to bring bad luck to any uh, man who wears it, so only females have ever adorned it. Oh. Okay. Interesting. Oh, is this... Oh, it's the fan making the noise. Okay. Do you want to jump down there and grab this thing? Yeah, I, I tried to dash and hit it, so yes, we did actually. It does work. If you dash and hit it, that completely and utterly works. Mothman. A cryptid sighted, in, uh, sighted during the 60s and 80s in West Virginia. Its shining red eyes are named for the fin-like appendages on its side. It uses its keen sense for blood to track down the source and feed on it. So we can totally insta-kill here if I dash. I have Good to know. I can also go up here seems to have no real purpose in life, but that's okay. Can't go over there. I'm assuming there must be a will seed around here for it to be so convolutedly designed. Come on, keep going. Now I'm gonna run and I'm gonna insta-kill you. I'll reveal your true nope, form. then insta-kill. Interesting. Either I wasn't dashing for long enough or uh, it's strong enough. Let's go. Ooh, low, huh? I oh, forgot that this might be weak to. Uh, I have a lot of single target stuff that might be weak to. But okay, I guess I'm just gonna shoot one. I kind of forgot they were completely immune to that. Uh, I don't know. They're still completely immune to it, by the way. Just thought I'd mention that again. Uh, hit them like that, just to lower their health slightly. Then Mazio. That's not Mazio, that's uh, Masayu. There we go. Hit him. Wonderful. You got another level up? Okay. Okay, we're done. Hurry up and move on. Alright, down here. Hey, we got another craft bit of crafting material. We haven't crafted in ages, but that's okay. This way? Uh. This way? No? This way. Yeah. Alright, we made it. The treasure's in here, yeah? Just past this building. We're definitely getting closer. I find it somewhat odd that you... We have yet to see anything about the mental shutdowns. Mm. Well, this palace is on the site of the corporate HQ, remember? If he never told any employees about it, we might not find any hints towards his involvement. Worst comes to worst, we're just going to have to get that info out of the shadow himself. Indeed. Anyway, let us hurry inside. I believe the factory comes next. Alright, not that way then. So if that's the way forward, then that's the wrong way to go. 
Uh, what? Somewhere. Yeah, okay. I was like, why won't it let me climb? Apparently I was just at the wrong angle or something. All right. This way. So I want to go the complete opposite way around, just in case we miss something. Because we appear to have gone a correct route that way. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, we went in here. He jumped down, then across. Wait, no. Then back. Uh, then here. Alright, this way. There we go. Oh, I was too far away. So if you're too far away, you can't do the insta-kill because you were, uh... Yeah. If you're too far away, you can't do the insta-kill because uh, you do the grapple hook. Interesting. Let's get him. Oh, and we get the instant kill. Perfect. Okay. Awesome. Grab that. I can feel it. I'll reveal your true form. Maybe I just don't get the instant kill because I'm not so high over leveled as I am usually. That's fine. What are we doing? Sure, why not? Okay. Um, switch to Morgana. Then we're gonna hit this one. Nice. Then Baton pass over to Haru. And hit him. Yeah, uh, let me your power. Yep, perfect. There's no need for that. Perfect. We picked him up. Nice. Let's catch your breath. Not bad. More XP, more money. All right. I can feel it. This way. Uh, so this thing gives us grapple hook. Yeah, and this then leads down to where we were before, I think. Pretty much, yes. Yeah. So this was just a shorter route down, which had some different loot. Okay. Fair enough. I thought it was still worth checking any anyway. Ooh. Wait, we need to wait a little bit here. This is bad, because one would spot us. Show me your true form. Got him! Okay, that worked. I'll reveal your true form. Yep. Didn't quite get that one, but that's okay. Uh, kill it. Oh, it didn't kill all of them. Okay. Baton pass over here, I guess. I'll see you. Baton pass. You know what? I'm going to baton pass to On. And hear me out. The reason I'm going to do it is that she gets some SP recovery. I think she'll still be able to kill it. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Every single time I'm like, oh, I'll just use a physical attack so I'm not wasting anything. There we go. I was just trying to get her some SP back, which I did. I got her four SP for that, but you know, it's fine. Nice, level 40. Nothing okay. for level 40, but he's pretty much on par with everyone else now. She's still a couple levels behind, actually, but it's fine. In we go. It's somewhere. Checking whether there's anything else in here. Nope. Okay. There should be a safe room around here, because usually when you... Yeah, so it's at the end. Usually when you enter a new area, there's immediately a safe room. Which is right here. As expected. Ah, a safe room. We're good here. Right, we're in our export line. Anyone got anything new to say? Ooh, we got a bunch of new stuff. 
going from the outside was a wise idea. It would have taken forever otherwise. Ah. Leaping from one platform to the next. Now that is proper phantom thief behavior. Ah. Why is this palace so big? Ah, I get, well, I guess it's at least partially since the actual building is really big too. How could this be? Never in all my days have I seen such a sight. What a shame I haven't the time to sketch it. Yes, what a shame. Uh, I'm actually going to use this. Well, I'm going to do something we never do. I'm going to use one of our SP recovery kits. There we are. Because we're just that little bit low thoughts? on SP. All right, let's get cool. moving. Um, I mean, it. what I could have done instead is just given us a single SP thing, and then we could have, um, like, I, I gave us a single SP thing, I could have then just switched out our party members. I do want Haru to continue getting XP, because she gets more XP being in the party, because we haven't finished Mishima's thing. Hmm? If that makes sense. Then... Sensing a will seed? Oh, perfect. Well, I was thinking we, there must be one nearby because we only found one, but that's okay. Is it this way? No? Well, we got this, which is good. A model gun. Nice. Oh, through the crawl space? Yeah, this looks like a will seed area. Ooh. Security lasers. I wonder if there's a way to turn them off somewhere. Alright. So we can't turn them off here. So we have to go somewhere else, turn off the lasers, then come back to the will seed. But at least we discovered it on the map, which is half the battle. Right. Well, actually, in the Kanashiro dungeon, half the battle was uh, figuring out how to get to it once we saw it. But that's okay. So is there something here? Hmm. Okay. Just being careful. This really is a factory, just like the name says. I wonder what they're making here. Huh. Do you think it's related to that Escape to Utopia thing? Hold on a sec. Ain't the guys in here moving kind of weird? A little bit. Unfortunately, this is the exact opposite of how you would imagine a Utopia to be. These conveyor belts and the positioning of the workers. This is almost identical to the company's bun factory. I can't believe this. At the very least, this is how Okumura views his workers. My apologies for saying so, Noir, but this is truly atrocious. Well, it'll all be under control if we can trigger that change of heart in him, yeah? Let's go. Okay. Ooh, and we got another view. I simply cannot believe this is how father views his employees. Noir. Alright. Uh, so we got two... There's like an area underneath here, I think. Yeah, there must be like an area underneath there. Just looking at the map. Oh, wait. Maybe we'll, we'll probably see it once we go through here, huh? Because this goes down slightly. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> okay. So we still need to turn off these lasers somehow. Uh, right. Just move up. Get it. Show me your true form. Oh, we've seen a little before. Weak to. Oh, it's weak to bless as well, though. So we could switch up to this guy and use this. That is crazy. That looks amazing. Okay. I hadn't noticed before, but Noir takes a bow at okay. the end of each uh, combat. That's kind of neat. Uh, I'm going to switch up my persona to one that's quicker because I like going first, so we have options. I'll reveal your true form. Is that an ambush? I mean, we ran directly into their face. Yes, it is. Ooh. You know what the middle one is as well. I don't know what it's weak to, but we know what it is. No, we don't. Ah, we saw this one in the uh, dungeon, actually. We don't know what it's weak to. Uh, yeah, you. And then use this. Uh, by dungeon, I meant mementos. Uh, 
Let's just try wind. Nope. Fire. Blocks. Okay, so it's probably ice then, if it blocks fire. Nice. Alright, so we can now baton pass back. And this should allow us to do an ice kill with Bufula. No, but it is frozen, which is good. Fire will work. So, uh, it nullifies fire. We haven't tried basic attacking yet. Uh, let's try like bless or something. Again. Bless is neutral again. Probably means curse is neutral, so it might be nuclear or psi. I guess. Okay. Anyway. It's just worth working out at this point rather than working it out when we need to later. I can feel it. Right, grab that. Nothing in it. Grab this one as well. Okay. So there's a way up there. So how do we get up there though? Ooh, grab this as well. You see that that's definitely a, a grappling see point. So do I need to be up here to get there? How am I getting to that thing? Oh, I thought that was climb for a second. Yeah, let's go have a look. So that's there. Do I need to be on top of this thing to get there? I think so. Yeah. Okay. Let's keep going. Ooh. Grab that as well while we're here. What's this? The robotic arm control console is currently undergoing a required system update. Please wait patiently. Okay. Just trying to pay attention to both, like, to the sides of us here. This scent, the treasure might must be right beyond that door. Is this going to be another one of them authentic whatever things? No, there's no authentication here. Kind of anticlimactic, huh? Sure, why not? Well, the easier the better, right? Let's go. Uh, I'm not ready to go yet, but that's okay. Focus. Oh, see, this one's not a lower thing than us, so... Oh, the arm broke. Wait. Whoa, we almost got crushed. That freaking hunk of metal broke way too goddamn easily. There is no point in complaining at this point. We'll be forced to search for another route. Hmm. You're right. Let's find something that will help us get past here. Hmm. I think we'd be able to make use of these fragile arms somehow. Okay. I was going to say that the um, thing on the other side was like equal level so we couldn't insta-kill it, but it's kind of irrelevant now, huh? So I guess i got to go back and break the arm. Or use the console. Yeah. Whoa. What the? Something came out. Huh. This is the control panel for that robotic arm. It seems we can use this to set it to either three times, five times, or ten times normal speed. But, but I'd better break if it was stuck at ten times speed for a long time. Changing arm speed ten times. There we go. Indeed. It appears to have broken. <sighs> it was dead like instantly. I know it was ten times normal speed, but still, that's weak. Yes. That just proves how truly overworked these machines are. It seems any increase in workload would have led to its collapse. Hey! Wait, but don't you think we might be able to walk on the broken arm? You should check it out, Joker. That was the reason why we did it, Haru. Uh, sorry, Noir. <laughs> I don't use anyone else's code name. I don't know why I'm worried about this one. But, you know, there we go. Show me your true form. Got it. Right. Ooh. Fantastic, we can continue testing this guy. Uh, so we need to test Curse, Nuclear, and Psy. Well, uh, I think I have Curse on here, so we'll test Curse. Resist, okay. Oh right, yeah, it's one of those. Did it just give itself Tetracorn? That's really annoying. What else is it weak to? Nothing, huh? Uh, let's try this. 
Just because we could. Uh, yeah, I'll take the reflect. So eyes rage. Ow. At least we got to reflect that one. Kind of feel like I should just kill it. Oh no. Uh, Sai? Is weak to Sai, of course. Yep, is weak to the new ability type we got. Of course, as is everything. Okay. Alright. Uh, let's switch up our persona again, up to like, I don't know, the 45 one. Then, uh, skill, Organa, and heal. Cool. I can feel it. Hey, hey. Grab that one. What's this? Wonderful. Okay. So this then lets us travel over here. Which lets us get to the will seed quicker. Yeah, okay. So that's all connected so we can get to the will seed. Now, I think that this is the second will seed because there's no enemy in front of it. And usually for the final will seed, there's like a mini boss. So that's why I think this is the second will seed, but we'll check what color it is when we get in here. Because if there isn't, if this isn't the uh, second will seed, then it means the other one was probably outside. Nice. Green. So we got our SP recovered. Yeah, so that was number two. So there's definitely another one out. Yeah. It's definitely uh, another one further in here. Which means there's probably another area so, uh, further in here. Right. Uh, let's go save while we're here. You know, we did quite a lot. We'll chuck in a save. I should Ooh, write something. we got something from Ryuji. Okay. Hey, Ryuji. What's up? I didn't want to go here. I wanted to uh, talk to Ryuji. There we go. <laughs> this palace is huge, but I guess the building it's based around was huge in the first place. Wouldn't it be awesome to work in a huge-ass building like this? I mean, okay. it'd be fine, I'm sure. <laughs> Um, yeah. Oh, uh, they keep saying this palace is huge, but like, I mean, like, guess in terms of scale it is. In terms of length of the palace, this seems like it's going to be quite short. I don't know. Maybe it's just me who's thinking that. Oh, we have to go uh, over here and then turn right. Yeah. That's fine. I guess we have been in it a couple of times now. Well, we, we went in it the fir like the first time and then had to come out again immediately, so... I guess maybe that that, that, that kind of changes how it feels in land. Shadow. Got it. Show me your true form. I think that we might actually have been the right level for this palace, since we're now at the correct level for all of these enemies. Uh, so any things we haven't checked are gun and nuclear. I mean, I can check nuclear, and then we can get gun checked, just so we have the full thing. I mean, we could also capture it, and that would do it. You're mine. Nothing, huh? Okay. Well. Didn't think it was going to be weak to gun, but that's okay. Thought we'd tanked it anyway. Or baton pass to Haru. Hit it with one of those. Uh, we already captured a Mothman, I think, so, yeah. Let's just, uh, all in. All out. Kill it. Cool. Hey, money and XP. I can feel it. Uh, so I, there's no, com like, command console around here, so we can't get that one to go weird. Although maybe we could, uh, like, if we can find one later, we can do that. That was close. Ooh! Just destroy it. Love it. Hey, we caught a little. I think we already have a little, actually. 
Yeah, because we knew all of its abilities, so we must have made a Lilum at some point. Oh, there's the thing we need over there. I'll reveal your true Didn't get this one, but that's okay. It's one of these guys. Uh, so I just want to hit it with Psy, I think. Wait, obviously it's only weakness, right? Yeah. So if I just hit it with Psy and then try and... Like, hopefully this doesn't kill it, then hopefully we can just capture it. Yeah, perfect. Let me your power. Then let's talk. I can't just lend my power to some Joe Schmo. It looks depressed. Don't trouble it with more info than it needs. All right, short answers. Any kind of old to be playing dress up? Come on, what's with the mask? Kind of cringy, don't you think? Sure is. So you're aware, and you're doing it anyway. That's fucked up, man. Yo, look at me. I know when I'm getting all sweaty. I'm listening, aren't I? Not at all. Why do I? Then why do I feel so goddamn sticky? You really piss me off now. Oh. <laughs> Just kills itself on us. All right. Well. I kind of hope that we might get the Yoshida thing pop up there and go, okay. ah, we'll, we'll just give it to you for free. Because that's his one, isn't it? We haven't seen it pop up, but I'm fairly certain it said, like, we get another chance or something. Isn't that right? Uh, Confidant, Yoshida, Man of the People, that was it. Um, where is it? Let's just skip negotiation when attempting to obtain. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Cool. Well, we didn't get it anyway. It was, it was a potential, which is good. Wait a second. Spotted gold at the corner of my eye. Can't leave without that moonstone. We need to be able to um, evolve our Clefairy. Right. Uh, grab this. And break the arm. Perfect. That gives us a way across. Hey! Look, we've gotten much closer. Yes, after quite the detour. Right, uh, around here? Nothing? Okay. Guess we'll jump down. Can I go along there? Nope. Okay. So then I should be able to break this one over there's arm as well. Yeah. That breaks, falls down, gives us another bridge. We can then go across it. Perfect. Head back up. Do a little run round. We'll grab that one. I figure if these had any relevance. Not really. I don't think they have any relevance whatsoever to anything. Nope. It's just the same letters repeating again, again and again, but I can't see a pattern immediately. A Show me your true Got him. Form. Right. Hey. Oh. And we have four lockpicks left, so let's open it up. What's inside? It's a Big Bang Axe. Oh, perfect. My, this is... Yeah, go ahead. Yes. So she now has a new axe, which is great. So she's now no longer at, like, she's better in all-ins, is what I should say. I was going to say no longer useless in all-ins, but it's not quite useless. Yeah, it's just more damage. So that should be good. I guess that's implying that we're probably going to come up on a mini boss or something soon. So it wants to make sure that you have a weapon that can allow you to get... That one makes... I just realized that one there is a big bang. Those letters make sense. But I guess it wanted to give you a weapon so your all-ins did more damage. And the sort of physical attacks did more damage at this point, because you'll need them for some reason. That's my guess, but maybe I'm wrong. Maybe they just gave it to you so you had it. It was just like, here's an upgrade. Oh man. There's still more? This factory's freaking huge. Come to think of it, what are they making this factory? Says Ahn. And we were told this was the bun factory, right? Which might lead them to Utopia. Show me your true I thought I'd try and get the instant kill. Ooh. Don't rush this. We have seen this guy before. 
Stay focused. I think we've also cap we've also made one of these guys before looking at that there. Not that. We are the better uh fighters. yeah, do this. To hit its weak point. Nope, didn't do anything. Uh Sure. Increase our attack. Then we'll hit it with fire and that'll be it. Perfect. Glad we won. Okay, let's move on. More XP, more money. I'm sure we faced that one in a okay. different um, palace, but it might just have been a in a challenge. Victory. Nothing in here. Okay. It seems. From the look of it, there's only one more door, and it seems we should head over there. So I'm looking for another will seed in here at some point. Hmm. This is. We will not be able to reach it without passing over what appears to be a hydraulic press. Even if we did go over that press, we'd still get messed up by those damn lasers. We gotta do something about those before we get to the press. Mm. It'll probably be a hassle, but I have a feeling it's our only option. We need to turn off those infrared lasers and deactivate the hydraulic press. Let's try and find some sort of controls for those. Okay. Can't go that way. Ah, yes. I'm sure that says something very meaningful. Fortunately, I can't read it. Uh, it might just say Big Bang Burger somewhere. And I'm like, ah, yes. How meaningful. Yes. It's just like, here's our latest offer. Get the Big Big Bang here. Show me your true Got it. Uh... That one? And then... Let's hit it with one of those, and they're dead. Yeah, I, don't, I was trying to think if there was a way I could have done that which would have led us to actually having the uh, knockdown. I think it would have been difficult. Nuke break, so... Negates nuke resistance on all fo on all foes. Cannot negate nuke wall. Okay. Hmm. Problem is I have to give up an ability for that. As I can give up flash bomb. No, you know what? I give up Dakunda. Moves all stat debuffs for all allies. It's interesting. But I can get an item that does the same thing. It just gave me so many break items. I'm like, I've got to take it just in case. Okay. Like, it might force a situation where we need easy. to use it. Show me your true this form. one's green, which I think means it has another uh, purple guy in it again. Yeah, there we go. That'll kill it, and then we get technical on the other two. Yeah. Let's go. And now we kill them. Ooh. Nice. We have right. money and XP. It's somewhere. Good work. Grab that. Okay. There's nothing else along here, so we must have to climb. No? Wait, what? Okay. Uh, I thought it was the way forward, was to climb up there. Maybe I'm crazy? Wait, what's this tick over here? Oh, it must mean this is what I'd use to progress. Ah, these must be the shift controls for the presses. You can select break, launch, or unpaid overtime. Oh. Wait, break is an option? We may be able to get past that problematic press if we can find the corresponding control panel. Let's do this, Joker. Now changing press, shifts, unpaid overtime. We are currently operating... We are currently in a state of constant unpaid overtime. For the good of the company, glory to our wonderful president, Okumura, and him alone. For real? Whoa, 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 hold up. What the hell did it mean, constant? Working unpaid overtime is just how these workers live, so setting it to that changes nothing. What a nightmare. Oh. I should have known. There is no benefit to us if nothing changes. We can likely ignore that option entirely. All right, lunch.
lunch seemed to work. It is now lunchtime. Let us consume our slop and gleefully regenerize. Lunchtime shall last for approximately 30 seconds. Whoa! Okay. I'll reveal your truth. An attack. I love our lunchtime still counting down while we're in here. That's a nice touch. What are these guys weak to? Wins. Oh, you Let's know what go. we could try? This might backfire heavily. Well, let's try switching to this guy and using this. Hopefully the middle one won't get killed by the instant kill bless and then uh, we can knock him down. Yes, perfect. That's what I wanted to do. So now I want to guard. Guard. Because we he didn't get killed by the instant kill bless so he took no damage. So now we can use this. And that will allow us to talk to him. It looks sad. Be nice and just give some basic vague answers. Yo, look what he did. He knocked me down, and now my goddamn watch is broken. Vague answers. Uh, like I care. Don't you got some kind of conscience in that tiny body? Didn't someone educate you? Um, this has been bugging me for a while, but is it just me or does something stink? Vague. Uh, it's just you, it's coming from you, or I smell a lie. It's just you? I guess we'll leave it at that. Man, you remind me of myself. Oh, it's all coming back. I'm not a shadow that lives here, I'm from the sea of souls of you humans. I'm Kum Panda, and from now on, I'm you. Nice, we got it. I wonder if it feels earned. We learned its weaknesses, we set up a situation where we could get it. Like, we didn't just randomly run into that one in Mementos. Okay. That's cool. Break time is over. Let us work even harder to account for our time wasted slacking off. Okay, cool. Uh, let's have a look at this one. Then. Uh, so stats. A Buddhist demon said to drain human life energy. He has three... Uh, sorry, he has dark skin, stands three meters tall, and sometimes changes his shape to a gourd. Odd, and known to have once served Rudra, uh, Rudra uh, the god of storms. Okay. Interesting. Uh, grab that one. So there's a console that can let us get somewhere else. Let's continue to destroy things so I don't check them each time. Hmm? Another one of them control panels, right? Should we set it to lunch again? Hmm. Yup. Actually, I did some research into these, and the other two options are meaningless. Break only lasted for like five seconds. For real? Five? What the hell are you supposed to do in five seconds? Take a deep breath. I should have known. Regardless, those options are no use to us. It's probably best we simply choose lunch from now on. Hold on, it looks like you can disable the infrared on this too. Aha! So this room is actually the one with the main console in it. We should probably disable the infrared before setting it to lunch. Disable security. As a cost-cutting measure, we will now disable security in some locations. Please continue to your mon to, uh, to monitor your own workspaces. Nice. You are unforgivable. To think the higher ups are just shoving all this stress onto the employees so things can go pleasantly for themselves. Well, now we can get over to that hydraulic press, right? Right, and now we use lunch. Nice. that lunch it. It's now lunch time. And now I can run back over. Except I don't want to run over. I want to go to the uh, other press that we already haven't used. Like the one to our left here. Joker! Show me your true form. And yeah. That's fine. Uh, two toilet demons. Uh, offer attack. We don't care about the timer, because we can get back over, I assume. Uh, nah, we'll just wait here, and then let you kill them both. Nice. That works. 
just like I thought. Okay. Yeah, break time is over. Okay, that's fine. Uh, snuff soul. I can cool. feel it. Wait, how do we get? Oh, we use this. Now changing press shifts. Plunge. Okay. It's now lunch time. There we go. Uh, I don't necessarily want to run straight over here anyway. Uh, you know, I think... Ah, we could, I suppose. Ah, could you not wait any longer to return for your rewarding work? That's right. Then enjoy the pleasures of hard labor to your heart's content. Cool. So I just wanted to have a look at this area that we've now unlocked. Yeah, there's nothing in here. Let's put lunchtime on again. Cool. Let's go. Show me your true form. And got it. Uh. Yeah. Okay. Then baton pass. Then use that, and then they're dead. Not quite, but you know, pretty much. Nice, couple level ups, new skill. Wind boost. All right, that seems good. Given that you use wind. Uh, hmm. Cures dizzy, forget, sleep, and hunger. Revives with 50%. <sighs> I'm going to get rid of Rick Arm because we can get revival items super easily and they're better. Like to try this Heat wave soon. is amazing. That's uh, fizzy, heavy physical damage. So, to all foes. We want to keep the one that powers up after a baton pass, but let's see. I think we probably get rid of Dormant Rush. Low chance of sleep isn't really worth it anymore. Ooh, what's Deadly Fury? Severe physical damage, which powers up after a baton pass. That's amazing. Yeah. Okay. I think that um, Yusuke is like one of our stronger members still. Because physical generally works huh? on most things. They weren't a big deal at all. Oh, yes. All right, so nothing back here. No. Okay. Just check into the sides here. Ooh, they're weak. Show me your true See, form. I thought if I got close and tried it, we might get the insta-kill. Oh well. Uh, wind and then fire. Baton pass. We missed one, unfortunately. But we can try uh, that. Missed again. Hey, we recovered some SP for no reason. Uh, guess do this. Then we can baton pass over here. Get more SP back for arm. And then fire. Don't know why I used the AoE one, but you know, whatever. It worked. Just like I thought. I really like mindfulness just giving us a random SP boost, because I didn't even notice that we were low. Okay. I can feel it. Didn't even break a sweat. So that that lets us get back, which we don't need to use, but can I turn off all of them permanently on this console? No. Okay. Uh so I guess we'll go through here. I can feel it. So this is a whole area. Interesting. Uh down here. This must be our safe room. Yeah. Perfect. Oh, a new safe room. And anyone got anything to say? We do. Okay, hello. Hey. I wonder if real hamburger factories are like this. If so, I don't think I can eat them anymore. Aww. 
no matter how much they no matter how much they work, they never get to see it end. Oh, well, you know, welcome to life. Right, and with that cheerful message, I'm going to end the uh, episode here. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.